Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for clicking on today's video. As you can tell by the title, I'm showing you some spring outfit ideas. I'm so excited about this video because I love all of these outfits so much. They're so wearable, they're affordable, and I reckon a lot of you guys can make these outfits out of bits that you've already got in your wardrobe at home. If you do like the look of anything, I will link it below. If it's out of stock, I will try and link something very similar. So if you do wanna shop anything I'm showing you, the links will be in the description along with my sizing for reference. If you haven't already, please don't forget to subscribe and like this video, it really does mean a lot to me. I hope you enjoyed the video and let's get into it with outfit number one. So let's start with what I'm wearing right now. So for this outfit, I decided to go with a pair of black skinny jeans. I know, it's 2022 and I'm still wearing skinny jeans. I'm never gonna stop, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I just, I still wear them. Do you still wear skinny jeans? Let me know if you still wear skinny jeans because on TikTok, it's like a crime to wear skinny jeans. But I'm wearing a pair of black Levi's, they're my favorite pair of skinny jeans ever, with this striped jumper that I recently got from Mango. You can swap this out for like a little cami top or a t-shirt or a jumper, it's so versatile, you can change the look so easily. For a little bit of warmth, I'm popping on this blazer that I got from Zara, I really like it. This is a very monochromatic outfit. When you roll the sleeves up on a blazer, I feel like it changes the whole look of a blazer, it just changes it for some reason, I don't know why. I feel like I'm going to school when I've got the sleeves down, I really do. As for a bag, I was trying to decide between my coach bag or my YSL bag. I do love this bag, it's really nice, but I would probably wear this more of an evening. Like I'd probably change this jumper to a shirt, a black shirt or a white shirt, put some heels on and go with this bag. But for a daytime look, I'm gonna go with the coach bag because it ties the white stripes in of the jumper. And then for shoes, I'm going with these little loafers. I've been wearing these so much. They're actually loose and they're from I couldn't tell you where they're from. I couldn't tell you where these are from because the label has rubbed off and I didn't buy them. But they're really comfortable, really like them. Um, and I've been wearing them a lot. I'm considering getting the Gucci loafers because they're pretty much identical to these. Um, and I just love them, I think they're so easy to slip on. If you obviously wanted to wear this outfit of an evening, like I said, change the jumper to a shirt, put some heels on with it. You can dress it up by putting on some heeled boots with it. You can dress it down even more by putting Converse with it or trainers with it. It's just such a versatile look and I love it all together. I think it looks so lovely, so versatile. And you can definitely wear this to work as well. It's a very like, kind of business cash, but still super casual, super comfortable. I really, really like this outfit. This dress I know you guys have seen me wearing before because it is an absolute spring, summer, autumn, winter wardrobe staple for me. I absolutely love this dress. I wear it all the time. It's one of those pieces that if I don't know what to wear, I know this always looks good. It's good for pretty much any occasion. You can make it look super casual. You can really dress it up. I would happily go for dinner in this dress and I would happily go to Sainsbury's in this dress. It is just the simplest dress ever. It's just a gorgeous little jumper dress. I love the tone of the beige. It's a beautiful beige color. It's not too brown, it's not too pink, it's not too orange. It's just the perfect creamy beige color. Oh, I love it. Obviously the whole sweater vest thing has been a massive trend for like the past year or so. It's definitely still in. I feel like jumper dresses aren't ever gonna go anywhere. This is just so perfect. It does all of the hard work for you. It's got the shirt built in. It doesn't go all the way through, so it's not super uncomfortable. As you can see, the shirt lining is just stitched in. This is just jumper and the same with the sleeves. It's just stitched in. So the dress is super comfortable, super cozy. It doesn't feel really bulky and like chunky. You know when you layer a shirt underneath something and you're just like rustling around? You don't feel like that in this dress. It's perfect. The way I pretty much always style this dress is with a pair of black knee-high boots. I do have a pair of cream knee-high boots that I will show you in the try and clip as well. If you like the lighter look of outfits, that could definitely work for you with the coach bag. But if you want to pair it with darker accessories, it totally works pair of black knee-high boots, a little black bag, it's just perfect. I love this outfit so much, it's just the best. It's one of those pieces in my wardrobe that I just wear over and over and over again. It's timeless, it's so wearable, and it's so easy. You don't even have to think about what you're doing. Dress, boots, bag, done. So simple, takes five minutes. I think it's just such a perfect thing to have in your wardrobe for those days where you're panicking about what to wear, you just throw this on, you look super stylish. I get so many compliments on this dress because it really is lovely. Next up I have this gorgeous chunky jumper. This is from H&M and every single time I link it, it sells out. So if it's not in stock right now, I will find a very similar alternative to this jumper because oh my God, I wear this so often. I feel like in the springtime, it's kind of hard to know what to wear, but I feel like you can't go wrong with a little vest top and a jumper over top. It is like the perfect amount 
of warmth and you can add to it with like a trench coat or something like that but it's just perfect and it looks so cute it's so easy to dress up or down this is the type of thing that i would wear either like running errands or going shopping or even going to like lunch or breakfast it's just such a cute little outfit you can obviously dress it down by popping on a pair of trainers or what i like to do to add a little bit of height is put a pair of black boots with it this is just the most simple outfit ever it's literally a chunky jumper black skinny jeans and boots but you look so put together it's so simple you don't have to think about it it's one of those outfits that you wear when you're like i don't know what to put on this is your answer it's just perfect it's so easy and i would just pop on my little ysl bag with it to kind of dress it up a little bit and you've got the perfect simple five minute outfit while i'm on the topic of chunky jumpers i decided to pop this one on and show you another alternative to the chunky jumper look i love this jumper so much every time i wear it i get so many compliments literally everyone that's seen me wearing it is like I need a jumper like that. It's so easy to just put on with jeans and boots. And I'm like, yeah, literally so easy to just put on with jeans and boots. I love this jumper so much. It's got a little bit of something going on. So it's not just boring, which is why I love the cable knit jumper as well, because it's chunky. It's cable knit. It's got a little bit of texture going on. Obviously, this one is quite loud, even though it's just black and white. You know, the waves and everything, the bat wing. It's got a lot going on, but it still looks so cute. I have worn this in a variety of different ways. I feel like you can dress this jumper up by putting a blazer on and some nice boots. Or you can dress down with some leggings and some trainers. My favourite way to style it is with a little pair of biker boots. I love these biker boots so much. They're either from River Island or Nasty Gal, I can't actually remember. It makes the outfit so casual, so dressed down and just super simple. I just think this is the perfect, easy, everyday outfit. So I thought I would show you a different variation of the chunky jumper and jeans. So this dress is a new addition in my wardrobe and I'm absolutely loving it. I've worn it so much. I didn't know if I was going to like it when I initially bought it, but I'm absolutely loving it. This dress is actually from Zara and I love it because I tend to gravitate towards darker colours. I know that like neutrals and beiges and creams and stuff are really in right now, but my personal thing is I just gravitate towards darker colours. I feel more comfortable in them and I feel like they suit me a little bit better as well. The thing that I love about this dress is I think it's really versatile. Obviously it is broidery anglaise which is very spring summer it gives that spring summer vibe but i feel like you can easily pair it with black so it means you can wear black tights with it when it comes to the autumn winter time and carry on wearing it it's not just a spring summer dress the way i've personally been styling it is with a pair of black knee-high boots i think these are from shoe and they were only like i'm gonna say they were either 60 something or 160 something but either way I would have happily paid 160 for these because I've had these for years. They're real leather and they're really, really good quality. They're really thick and soft on the inside as well. They're just really, really nice. These are also the perfect heel height as well. They are not too tall. They're just the perfect heel. I could wear these all day and not be uncomfortable. I love them. It's just a really cute dress. I love it. Super simple, so wearable. And yeah, I think I'm going to get a lot of bang for my buck, I think the saying is. This dress has become one of my absolute wardrobe staples. It's from River Island. It was super affordable. They've got it in a few different colours, but I decided to go with the black one because, as I said, I do tend to gravitate towards dark colours. But the thing about this dress is it's got little bits of white in, so I feel like this with a pair of little white sandals could be absolutely adorable, or a little pair of white heels could be so cute. But in the springtime, when it's a little bit colder, I've been pairing it with boots. I just think a little pair of black boots goes so well with this dress. It looks so cute it doesn't look odd because obviously the dress is black and i feel like it's just a really good way to warm up a dress for the springtime because in the uk the spring isn't always that warm i feel like we get a mix of like hot freezing and just mild days so it's kind of hard to know how to dress in the spring in the uk because we've got rain snow sun wind literally any type of weather conditions you can think of we get in the uk which is why there is such an array of outfits in this video from like jumpers and jeans to skirts and jumpers to just dresses because it's so hard to figure out the weather here i feel like i've given you a good variety of temperature options in this video hopefully i pretty much always pair this dress with my lovely little coach bag i feel like the whites together just look really cute it brightens up the outfit a little bit as well it just looks really pretty together this dress is so comfortable it's stretchy around here as well so if you're bloated it kind of just flows over your tummy it's just one of those dresses that are super flattering if you're going to be eating a big meal you don't have to worry about having like a little food baby because this dress is just so flowy and flattering and easy to wear and comfortable it's just an easy breezy dress i love it so cute 
this outfit is such a classic for spring a little trench coat this is brand new from river island i love it so much it's so gorgeous i love these little ties on the sleeves i love the kind of woody neutral buttons on it as well i just think it is so cute i just think it is the perfect little trench coat and there are so many different ways to style this outfit i've popped it on with my favorite pair of mom jeans which are from mango honestly if you're looking for a pair of mom jeans mango have the best jeans i've tried like 50 Different brands of mom jeans and the mango ones are the best by far. Super comfortable, super stretchy, super flattering. They're just perfect. But I popped on my light wash blue denim mom jeans, a little white t-shirt, and I feel like with shoes, there are lots of different ways to go about it. And the same with bags as well. So I feel like I could pop on my Vader trainers, which match the white with my top, and then pop on a black bag to tie in the black V. So if I did that, I would definitely go with a black bag and style it like that to tie in the two colors together. Or I would maybe pop on my Converse and my coach bag with it as well, which would look super cute. I love a good pair of Converse. I wear these all the time. These are the dainty style of Converse. They're kind of like a slim fit. They're not for slim fit feet, but they just are a lot daintier than regular Converse. They're very like cute on. I just really like them. I think a good trench coat is a definitely a wardrobe staple in the springtime and this is gorgeous and I just think it is really really beautiful. I love all the different like layers, it's kind of like Sherlock Holmes vibe, I don't know. I really really like this trench coat, it's one of the best ones that I've tried on this season. While we're on the topic of blue jeans I had to pop on a little white shirt with my blue mom jeans because this is an outfit that I wear constantly in the spring summertime. I just do the little tie, you know, the kind of like... 80s tie with the mom jeans it's just so cute i know you've seen it a million times but i'm just reiterating how freaking cute it is your options with this are honestly endless you make the base of the outfit with the blue jeans and the white shirt you can put on converse you've got a super cute little outfit put your hair into a little like ponytail oh you're so cute and casual love that for you little pair of sandals and a beach bag Oh, stunning, beachy queen. Or do you want to have a little bit of a classy moment? Do you want to do the slingbacks with a nice little bag? Style icon. Oh my god, this with the trench and the coach bag. Stunning. Honestly, this is kind of giving me like capsule wardrobe vibes because all of the pieces I'm showing you kind of switch in and out with each other so easily and make completely different outfits and completely different vibes. I love all of these bits. Honestly, they are wardrobe staples for me. Talking about wardrobe staples, let's move on to the jumper and skirt combo. This jumper was a little bit more expensive than what I would usually spend on a jumper. It's from the brand Everlane. I've never purchased from them before. I didn't know what to expect. I've seen a lot of influencers talking about them, influencers that I really like and really trust their opinions. I bought this. Oh my God, I love it. I literally wear this so often. I don't have anything gray in my wardrobe. I don't really gravitate towards gray in general, but this jumper is just, amazing i cannot floor it it's amazing whenever i feature it everyone is like where is that from i love it so much it's everlane i'll link it in the description definitely get it it's gorgeous i got it in the size medium because i wanted it to be a little bit oversized a little bit kind of like boxy and chunky so let's pop this on with some skirts this is by far the best jumper i have ever ever bought yes it was more expensive than any jumper i think i've ever bought i'm pretty sure maybe on par with like a ralph lauren jumper around there but oh my god i wear it so often it's so soft it washes really really well really really well it's got a really faint kind of diamond pattern you see super faint just so beautiful such a gorgeous shade of gray as well and i literally wear this two to three times a week no exaggeration if you follow me on instagram and watch my instagram stories you will see me in this jumper constantly because it's so comfortable and i wear it in every single way you can think of so the first time I'm styling it is with this little black mini skirt that I got from Zara. I styled this up the other day with a pair of knee-high boots and my new black bag and the outfit was stunning. Everybody loved it on Instagram as well. I posted an Instagram picture in it and everyone was like, oh, I love that outfit. It's so cute. And even Lou was like, you look so nice in that. So gorgeous, so beautiful, so easy and a great way to style a skirt in the spring. I also got this beautiful little floral tennis skirt not too long ago and I feel like the grey tone just goes absolutely perfectly with the tones in this skirt. This is from ASOS, it wasn't very expensive, I did get it last year so I don't know if it's still in stock. If it's not I will find alternatives and pop them in the description but I recently got a pair of new cream boots. And I feel like that could be a really cute look. But you could also pair it with a pair of Converse and make it super cute, super casual, very just kind of like fun, free, easy. But honestly, this jumper is a staple in my wardrobe. I wear it constantly with leggings, with jeans, 
with leather jeans, with skinny jeans, with jeans and heels, jeans and boots, jeans and trainers, with skirts. It's just gorgeous. If you put a little shirt underneath and have the collar poking out, oh, I love this jumper so much. I'm so glad I got it. I might actually get it in a different color because I really love it. This is a dress that I have had in my wardrobe for a really long time because I feel like it is super timeless and also super wearable. It's just this really beautiful navy blue tea dress. I love the sleeves. They're super feminine. They've kind of got that like vintagey feel to them, which you guys know if you've been following me for a while. I love that little vintagey vibe. It just looks so feminine and gorgeous. I honestly don't wear this dress enough because I really do love it and I feel so beautiful in it as well, which is just really nice. I think it's just so easy to wear. This is one of those dresses that is definitely more of like an occasion dress. I feel like you could potentially wear this with trainers, but I would definitely dress it up with like a little pair of sandals and probably my coach bag. I love the look of navy and white together. I think it's really pretty. Doesn't that just look lovely? I think the color combo of navy and white is just so gorgeous. I get a lot of comments and messages from you guys saying, please show some outfits that I could maybe wear to work. I think this is definitely one of them. I think this is such a beautiful dress. Obviously it's a midi dress. This could even work as like a wedding guest dress. It's so versatile, so wearable. It's just really simple and easy to style in different ways. I feel like this could definitely work for work. It's very modest, very pretty. I feel like a teacher would 100% wear this. Um, and I think with a pair of sandals or trainers or little heels would look really, really cute. So hopefully this is a good option for you guys that are looking for something to wear to work in the spring summertime. So for the final outfit, I thought I would show you one of the outfits that I wear over and over and over again. I kind of created this outfit last year and I've worn it so many times since. It's just so easy to wear and so gorgeous and classy as well. So to start with, I have popped on this beautiful little jumper from River Island. I really, really like it. I love the cut of it. I think it's so pretty. Um, very kind of on trend right now. I think it's really gorgeous. I love the look of it. And it's also kind of like... Um, it looks like a little corset if you wanted to wear it to show that detail off. And then I've paired it with a pair of mango mom jeans, the best mom jeans in the world. Honestly, you guys, if you haven't tried them yet, you are missing out. Even if you buy them and return them, honestly, try them out. They're really, really good. Another absolute wardrobe staple for me is a camel coat. If you follow me for a while, you have heard me ramble on about this Hobbs coat about a million times. But honestly, it is justified. I love this coat. It is so gorgeous. It's just the perfect camel coat and you cannot convince me otherwise. It's just stunning. The quality of this coat is just absolutely outstanding. It is incredible. It's like nothing. Oh, it's like nothing else. It's so gorgeous. It's just silky and just, oh, look at it. You can honestly tell on camera how nice it is. It's just like, oh, it's just the best material ever. Honestly, it's a little bit more expensive, but I have had this for maybe three years now and i wear it almost every day i honestly do it's just the best coat ever so my favorite way to style this outfit up is with these little slingbacks because obviously they match the coat perfectly and they also match the black and then i also pop on my coach bag so i've tied in the jeans with the bag the shoes match the top and the coat it's just a really gorgeous coherent outfit definitely work appropriate as well 100 percent work appropriate these shoes are super comfortable. I don't think they're sold anymore, but I do have some really great dupes. These are dupes for the Chanel ones. Um, so if you feel like spending that much on a pair of shoes, get the Chanel ones. Um, honestly, I would probably say it's worth getting the Chanel ones. If I wore these more, I would definitely invest in them because they are beautiful. Um, and they just make any outfit look really gorgeous and timeless and classy. And they're super... They're a super low heel, so they're really easy to walk in, but I love these. There are lots of dupes out there. I will link some in the description that are most similar to this, but I just think this is the perfect outfit. It's so gorgeous, so versatile, so easy to wear, and I feel like it's definitely work appropriate as well. So they are all of the outfits I have to show you guys today. I really hope you've enjoyed this video. I hope you found it interesting, helpful, entertaining, whatever it may be. I hope you enjoyed it and got something out of it. If you did like anything that I showed you in today's video, it will be linked in the description box along with my sizing for reference. So hopefully that helps you guys out. Hopefully you found some new bits and some new outfits for the spring, summertime, all of these bits are so versatile and so interchangeable. Definitely kind of like a capsule wardrobe, 100%. You can wear all of these items in so many different ways. I was just trying to pick out a favorite or like some key staples from this video, but I honestly wear all of these items so often that it is so hard to pick. I feel like if you've got these items in your wardrobe, you can make a million different outfits out of them. They're so versatile, so gorgeous, and I really hope you guys found this video helpful. Please follow me on TikTok and Instagram. I would really, really appreciate it. And I will see you guys hopefully next week with a new video. Bye. Love you. Have a good day. Bye.